Hey guys, this is Rob, and today I want to talk about you know, are online courses reliable enough to get a job in South Africa? Uh, basically, well, not really South Africa only, but well, I mean South Africa, so it kind of makes sense why I'm saying that, right? Um, okay, so um, as for me, um, what I did was I didn't go to college, I didn't go to university. Um, I did take some courses though. Uh, in programming, um, but I'm not gonna say me getting a job in programming was because of those courses, right? Because I didn't even um, show show them my certificates or whatever, right? From Udemy or who knows what, right? So, so I mean, okay, let's get started, right? So basically, guys, the world is kind of different. I'm sure you can notice it yourself. Um, things have changed. You, seems like even big companies like google for example are now hiring people without uh, without university or college degrees right so basically what i noticed from you know what i realized was that i mean obviously it's not for all degree or all careers you can't be a doctor with a skillshare course right you can't be i don't know a pilot with a maybe you can but the chances are small right but there are certain careers that you can learn online and you know pretty much get the same wage or work same uh, salary uh, as a person who went to university right and so from my own from my own uh what do you call this the way i see it uh i don't think that it's about the it's about the certificate from udemy from skillshare I think that it's about your portfolio, how strong is your portfolio, right? So let me give you a number of uh, careers that that you can pretty much do without having to go to university, right? So, yeah, okay, guys. Right, guys. So um, basically, this is what I had in mind, right? So number one, programming. Um, Programming, from my experience, I learned... A lot via youtube i've been doing it like since 2014 or 2015 right so um i learned a lot online and uh what made me you know i don't know what made me uh, i guess a good developer was just building a lot of projects over the years websites for people i mean a lot of them i didn't get paid in the end but i built my my skill set uh while you know while just playing around right so um building websites for people and stuff like that right so programming is an easy one um not really easy i mean it's easy to learn how to code you know for loop each whatever loop but the implementation um you have to practice and i guess this also applies for university students right so so programming is number one uh, that you could uh try out if you have a little bit of passion about it um number two is um graphic design now graphic design um graphics graphic design is i mean it's getting easier um uh now since we have tools like canva or all these other other tools right but basically you want to learn new things like your photoshop right um um your illustrator right and i have a friend who does that and he has a very he studied like animation but he's doing more of like graphic design right so it's a good one um you, i've heard someone i've heard of a story of someone who got employed and is getting like seventeen thousand, right um because uh i think 17 if not he started off with like fifteen thousand, and then now he's getting paid like seventeen thousand, right so what he did right? so what he did was he went and you know displayed them display showed his portfolio to these people right um and they were impressed old white men they were impressed they're like okay cool <laughs> um, work with us right so graphic design if you have some passion in things to do with graphics or you know ah look what we have here um Right, guys so basically there's even other career options that aren't even provided at like most universities right so for example if you look at something like social media marketing it's kind of new it's very 
new actually um yes you can study marketing but at the end of the day if i have grown a page to about uh, a hundred thousand <laughs> uh, followers um i think it's much more better to give me the job than someone who did marketing and knows some theory about marketing because i have done it before I, so things like social media marketing there's a lot of great skillshare courses udemy courses um skillshare i mean it's kind of subscription based and whatnot but i i recommend you take udemy for this one right um yeah so that's number three um, um okay so number four right um number four could be um videography or i don't know what it's called right in video editing right so you could learn that i have a friend for example you see the things that i'm sharing with you i i am seeing some people doing them without the need of university degrees right so i have a friend for example who who does it and is getting a good income like he's still studying and still going to school and he's getting like a very good income like you know like a very decent good income right um so you could learn that um editing videos but i guess this one is kind of more practical or well, the shooting part of it right if you wanna shoot videos and stuff i'm not really sure what they are called but you have to practice and for him um he had been taking photos i think maybe for for three years or something because i remember you would borrow like my other friends um uh a camera and go and shoot uh like it shows and stuff so if you are an outgoing person and you love shooting then i guess that could be for you right so guys this is what i have for you <laughs> um please like the video if you enjoyed it uh and also if you like the transitions uh yeah just comment it down below subscribe